All right, we're back out of Mel Muscle. Today we are filming uh, back day. We're gonna start on deadlifts. We're not going super, super heavy today. We're gonna be doing uh, four sets, four working sets. Uh, we'll do two warm-ups and then four working sets, so six in total. Uh, we're gonna be trying to hit reps today, so we'll do 12 to 15 reps uh, per set. Um, yeah, hope you enjoy. Okay, we've done two warm-up sets. So we started on 40, 60 kilos. Then we went up another 50 kilos. Uh, 40 from there. Now we're checking on another 50 kilos. So this will be your first working set. We're gonna go for 12 reps, 15 reps on this working set of four. So, yeah, see how we go. Okay, so we've done four sets now. Four working sets of 160 kilos. 180. So we did four sets of 180 of 12 reps of four sets. So um, that completes that list for now. Now we're gonna go on to, go in the other room, we're gonna play, do a rowing motion now. So follow us down. All right guys, so next up we're going to be doing the um, alternating upright row. We're going to be doing two hands at a time. We're going to do four working sets. Um, just start heavy, finish heavy. About 12 reps at a time. So next up we're going to be doing uh, four sets, 12 reps again of the close grip pull down. So this one here, when you do these, just want to sit in the seat, arch your back, and row through to your lower lat, so we're trying to hit. As you, as you can see, Jezza is trying to squeeze his insertion point of his lower part of his lat as he's coming down into the movement. The whole idea of this is, is to get full long engagement or extension into contraction. So he's trying to contract the lower part of his insertion point. What I'm trying to do here, when, I, when I'm trying to do a close grip pull down, I'm trying to grab my hand as close to the attachment point to the bar, or the joining part to the bar closest to me, as close as I possibly can. And it allows you to force your hands forward to get a bottom squeeze and a harder squeeze with inside of your lat. So as I'm pulling down, I'm pulling down as far as I possibly can. If I go to the top end of my chest, I'm shortening the range. So I'm trying not to short, shorten the range by any means. I'm actually trying to get as far down to the insertion of the lower lat as I can. So instead of you going halfway in the bar and going just to your chest, try and bring it down to your sternum, which will allow your contraction to be a lot more harder, a bit more stricter, and you, the weight will probably be half of what you normally would do. 
you will feel a bit more of a burn than just trying to move weight, try and squeeze and contract the muscle more. So next up guys, we're gonna be doing a superset of the uh, Techno Gym lat pull down. You get a really good squeeze on this one because you can contract your back really close together because of the way it's biomechanically made. So we're gonna do 12 reps on here. I'm gonna come over here with a rope or a straight bar you can do these with. Overhand rows. I'm just gonna rep out 15 on here, just like that. Squeeze in the back. Give that a go, it's a good finisher. So that concludes our uh, back for today. Um, we're currently four weeks out as of tomorrow, which is Sunday. Uh, four weeks out from the IPB VIX. So um, yeah, next next workout will probably be a chest session. Um, chest. So keep an eye out for that one. But um, today was heavy at the start. Moved through from deadlifts. We did four working sets at 12 reps. We moved on to the uh, high row to hit mid trap. We stayed heavy with that. We did four sets of 12 reps. We then came down to the close grip pull down, which we did five, actually we did six sets of that. And we did uh, 12 to 15 reps each time, getting a really good contraction on that. We then moved to the superset of lat pull down and overhand rows, which we did 12 reps on the lat pull down and 15 on the overhand rows to finish off back. It's a good finishing exercise, a lot of blood volume, um, and just gets, gets the back toasted for the end. So, yeah. Yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Stay tuned for the next one in uh, next week. Thanks guys. See you later.